happens when an urgency clause bill is returned to its house of origin on concurrence. Joint Rule 27 uh, deals with concurring in amendments, adding an urgency section. And it provides that when a bill has been passed in one house and is amended in the other house by the addition of an urgency clause statute, when it returns to the house in which it originated, the house of origin for a concurrence in that amendment, there's a specified procedure and vote and it's as follows. The presiding officer shall first direct that the urgency section be read and put to a vote. If two thirds of the membership of the house votes in the affirmative, then the presiding officer directs that the question of whether the house should concur in the amendment or other amendments is then put to a vote. And if two thirds of the membership of the house votes in the affirmative, then concurrence in the amendments are effective. If the affirmative vote uh, on either question of urgency or the amendments is less than two thirds of the membership of the house, then the obvious effect is refuse, uh, refusal to concur in the amendments. And there you would follow the normal procedures for a measure that is non-concurred in by the house of origin. <clears throat> 